Hello, and this is Chrome FX Films today with a tutorial, but I will be showing you a multiplayer game that I have been working on in Unity 3D with Smart Fox. So, you can make this. They have uh, tutorials on it on, in the Unify community, which you can just search and it will come up. And you, I have made this game using that, and I am going to show you what it looks like. It's going to be press make that one. When you start up the game, it comes in with this login menu. I have modified the script a bit so there is no like username and password thing, and it just says quick match because the. Uh, I liked it that way. <laughs> when you click quick match, it starts loading up the actual map, which can hold up to 20 people for free. The Smart Fox server can do 20 people. And if you want to do more, then you gotta start paying. It goes up to 50 people, then 100 people, then thousand people or something like that, and then it's infinite. But it gets more expensive. You can uh, download the Smart Fox server so you can run your own networking games. Uh, this game actually works. I've played with multiple people and. This worked just fine. It, the animations work, and it's been a lot of fun just walking around in the map. Uh, if you wanted to do any other scripts for uh, over the network, you would have to make sure you can control the remote player and the local player. All the details are in the tutorial. So. As you can see, I have the server started up. You can't run the multiplayer game and walk around in it if your server is not started up. You can tell if it's started up because right here, uh, it says server ready. All right, the game is running really slow because this program is creating a lot of lag. So I'm just going to show you the map through the editor. Alright, I have loaded up the actual map. As you can see, it's very big. Um, the size of a player is smaller than one of those trees. So, uh, this is a pretty decent sized map. I am extending it um, over there. You can see on the, uh, the, the sand part, that's an, uh, another island I'm going to be adding on later. Uh, but this is a good start, and it's still under construction, but it's cool so far. Over on this end, a dock, and also on the other side there's a dock, but on this side, which is selected, there's a portal. And if you go through the portal, you pop out on the other side of the dock, which is cool, because it saves a lot of walking time. Uh, in the map, I have the... Uh, the player controller and this network controller game object which um, the tutorial uh, has a lot of scripts that you can um, get and these are a lot of the scripts that you will be using uh, you have the player spawn controller, the chat controller so you can chat and the chatting works great uh, I found that very successful and entertaining Marfox servers come with a search safety text reader so if you type in any uh, bad words or anything it'll bl ban you or block you or kick you off and stuff like that so uh, you have the GUI game and then the network controller split the script all of these help run the game and uh, when you complete the tutorial you should have something like this. You won't have the map, but you can make your own map any way you want it. Uh, just place the spawn points, and then you got a network game. So thanks for watching. I hope you can uh, make your own network game someday, and have a great day. Thanks.